hi my dear leos welcome here i am salgi if you're new here on this channel we heal and we grow together you want to join the family do well so subscribe to the channel if you're a returning subscriber a big welcome to you so leo let's see what is coming true for you in regards to love this is going to be a collective energies take what applies to your situation and leave the rest for others you want a personal reading a personal guidance on your situation information for that would be in the description box so leos let's see what spirit have for you today let's see i've already shown for your cards you have the three of pentacles i see you have the emperor you have the king of cups you have the world You have the Six of Cups. You have the Four of Wands. You have the Knight of Pentacles. The Seven of Cups. And the Page of Wands. I see the overall energy. Overall energy, you have the Sun. All right, Leo. Let's see what's here. So it could be connecting to an Aries, Leo, Sagittarius, Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. They could even be a Libra, Gemini, Aquarius. So Leo, I see someone that is in love with you. And want to work on this relationship with you. For some of you, um, this person could be older. For some of you, it doesn't have to be. They could be older than yourself. This is also giving me the energy of this person not making their intention known to you yet you could have a secret admirer someone that have feelings but haven't said anything to you yet this is someone that could be keeping a close eye on you they could be watching you could work in the same field with this person could be a boss at the workplace this person could even be married for some of you. I see the same line of work here. See the same line of work here. Someone wants something long term with you. They do. They want something long term with you. Overall energy, the sun, Leo. A lot of you are coming into happiness in regards to your love life without even realizing it that you are about to be very happy the universe is bringing love your way the universe is bringing someone your way this person could already be in your life for some of you they could already be in your life now hearing this person is exactly what you've imagined or what you've prayed for. So it's going to be like a very quick movement in regards to this um, connection. This is unlike the usual this is not your usual type of relationships that you've been having there is something different here about this one so as is some, for some of you here that a lot of you will be moving in with this person very quickly or things will be moving very fast with you and this person yeah i feel for some of you this person is already in your life why for some of you right now they are in your energy i feel strongly here 
so if you are single watching this video I see love coming towards your direction there is a lot of fantasy a lot of imagination on someone's mind when it comes to you they see you and they imagine so much they imagine a lot I don't know I see someone here counting down to when they get to see you again like the counting down to when they will get to be with you if there has been any issue of delay in your life in your love life precisely that is coming to an end that is coming to an end you're closing off that cycle the word and the knight of pentacles you're closing off that cycle three plus four four five six seven seven of cups Mm. connected to the chariot cancer energy coming to their Aries energies here they want to be your man they want to be your woman they want to be the person for you they want to be the person for you Someone want to be a person, want to build something real and sustainable with you. They want to make you happy. Then, yeah, they want to make you happy. Mm-hmm. Some of you could be seeing synchronicity like 10 10 a lot or 1 1 11 11 a lot here uh, a, a chapter a face is closing off in your life i feel like a lot of you are about to experience the good time when it comes to love i mean life is in seasons right so I feel like you're coming into your own season of love. Could be you've been um, experiencing the stagnant energy. This yeah you have here, you deserve love coming to you here. Could be you've been experiencing a lot when it comes to relationship. It feels as though for some of you, you're always attracted to the wrong people. Or you're always attracted to unserious people. That is about to change. That is about to change. Happy times are here for some of you when it comes to your love life. Let's see what is in the Oracle card. Spirit for Leos. Collective energies, your love life. For Leos. Yeah, I love that. Leos. I see that some of you would have more than one person in your energy. I see here. I also see message of love coming to here for you guys. Some of you could be in a sense relationship. I probably see someone older than you coming here. Okay. The other older, the other person almost the same age, while a younger energy is here as well. Let's see. 
Spirit for Leo's and you guys still love. What's in the energies for my dear Leo's in regards to love? What's in the energies for Leo's in regards to love? Thank you, Spirit. What's the energy for Leo's in regards to love? Leo's, you have separation. Time apart from your partner is on the horizon. For some of you, yeah, this is um, someone you're currently separated from. Hmm. This is someone you're currently separated from. This is someone from your past that will be returning. Why for some of you the universe is saying that whomever that is not going to bring you this happiness whomever that is not aligned with your plan for you they would separate you from that person to create space for someone serious to come in so for some of you you would be experiencing issues with whomever you're with and that might lead to separation with you and this person once you separate from this person it would not take long someone new will come the universe will send someone into your life i see here this person they will marry you like quickly they will marry before this other person would even have the chance to realize that um, they, are, they, they, they want you or they need you. You're, you're, you're far in a, a serious relationship. You're moving into a serious relationship. We have playfulness. So a lot of you are going to be separated from someone that is playing with you. Someone that is playing with your feelings. There's going to be separation in regards to that. And once the separation happens, trust me, it's going to be like the perfect timing that the universe is waiting for to bring you this person. You see? Yeah, we have unrequited love. There is not enough attraction or chemistry to keep this. I see a relationship ending here, Leo. This person could even be someone that is married. They could be married. They are not making the effort. They are not putting effort into you. They are not putting effort into you and the connection. They are not. For some of you, the person you are even thinking might not be your person. Yeah? The person you are thinking might not be your person if you're currently with that person right now the universe is saying there's going to be separation that person do not love you as much as you love them they don't they are just out for the fun i see here they are out for the fun Leo, some of you, I see someone like coming from nowhere, okay? It's going to feel like a dream to you. How you will end up with this person. This could be someone new in your energy. Some of you, like I said, they're already in your life. You're already talking to this person. They will make you realize that you have been wasting your love on the wrong person for a long time. This person will show you what you have been missing. If you're holding on to this energy, you have to let it go. You have to separate yourself from this energy. You have to separate yourself. You know what i'm talking about in turn in your heart 
when someone is genuinely in love with you you will have no doubt in regards to how they feel towards you if you do have doubt you are not sure their action is not matching their words they are not coming true they are inconsistent they lie a lot they cheat all those are no qualities of someone that is in love mm -mm, it's not the quality of someone that is in love You've got something better coming here. Let's see. Why well, the three of pentacles here, Spirit? We have the six of pentacles. Balance. I see balance here. Mm. A lot of you, I, I feel, excuse me, a lot of you are feeling, um, could be feeling disappointed it could be with an air sign person okay could be feeling like you wasted your time with this person let's see why is the emperor here for leos we have the tower coming to here mm -hmm. leo you're in for some kind of a surprise here i see you're in for some kind of a surprise. You're in for a surprise here. This could have something to do with a Gemini or a water sign person, even an Aries person. I see the universe here. They will try to keep someone away from you. They will try to keep someone away from you. Why is the King of Cups here? We have the Eight of Cups. Hmm. A lot of you here, I see that you will be walking away from someone. Okay. Until you move away from this person, you are never going to get that your heart desire when it comes to a partner. You won't. What's the word here for Leo's? You have the Empress. Yes. Definitely. A new person in your energy. I also see that some of you like this person. They are your blockage. They are your blockage. They will try to interfere with what's coming for you. This blissful situation that I am saying. They will try to interfere in that. Some of you that has been dealing with this energy, whenever you seem as though you want to move on, this person shows up. Whenever you seem as though you want to move on, they will try to give you a reason to stay. They have been blocking you. They have been blocking you. Right now, you could be in separation with this person. But the moment you start talking to someone new, you start giving someone else an attention, they show up. They come around. They come around. And some of you, they are your blockage. Hmm. Why are the Six of Cups here? We have the temperance. Sagittarius energy coming through. Hmm. Definitely someone that wants to restore balance in the situation. Let me say. One foot in, one foot out. Unsure of what they want. With its connection. Why is the fourth one here? 
We have the six of wands. Six, six, six. I see someone in your energy that will not free you. They will not let you go. I feel this is someone that you were married to. There could be separation with you and this person, or they could be married. A married man, Libra, Cancer, energy coming through. Eight of Wands. Yo, I see travel here. I see travel long distance relationship. I see. Why is the Knight of Pentacles here? The Ace of Cups. Ace of Wands. Hmm. Finally, your heart desire. Well, actually, someone is not happy about that. This is giving me the energy or someone wanting to keep you trapped. Okay. I want to keep you. Someone needs a blockage here. Why is the Seven of Cups here? They are a blockage. They have the lovers. Position to be made here. Six, 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 six. Six is the number of abundance. It's also the number of decision making. Someone is about to make a serious move here. About to make a serious Yeah, definitely. Your wish will be coming true. Yours. But I feel like it all depends on the decisions that you take moving forward. That wish you're waiting for, that which you, which you are expecting, you will get. But probably not with someone you thought. Mm. Why is the page of wands here? The king of sword. Who is this king of sword energy? Is it my so this person have a lot to say to you? Must do they have so much to say to you? Could be someone you have not spoken to in a while. You felt like you had a connection with this person in the past. What is this wedding energy all about for my dear Leo's? The third Leo. Take this from me. Take it from me. A lot of you are going to be getting married very soon. And it might not be to whom you are thinking, I see here. We have the wedding card, Ten of Pentacles and the Sun. This might be with someone new, I see here. I see things happening really, really fast, really, really fast. Someone will try to block you. They will try to bring their own offer. If you see that you're moving on with someone serious, they might reach out to you and you will tell them, no, I found someone serious. I have to keep it moving. And they would come with a half ass offer to you. But I tell you something. If you take that offer, you go back to square one. And you miss an opportunity. <laughs> a lot of you, when you are separated with this person, when the universe is about to bring in someone new into your energy, they run back into your life. And they stop the process. That is something they have been doing. That is how it has been working. That is the spirit of delay. Spirit, I want to keep you stuck. At the end of the day, you might not end up going anywhere with this person. They might not end up even getting married to you. 
a law a word um is enough for a wise use your head leaders stop this cycle there is marriage in your energy believe me or not there is marriage in your energy someone is coming to marry you like i said for some of you this could be like a new person you're talking to right now but this influence this part person this person you keep going on in circle with they might play a big role in making sure that does not happen they might not do it intentionally but it all depends on the decision that you make with your life the decision you make with this person a lot of you have been in this circle for a long time by now you're supposed to be settled settled down with someone supposed to be married to someone but you kept allowing this to happen when they tell you that you are about to be getting married you hear from a tarot any personal reading Some of you at some point you could feel that okay this is coming but it never happened it's nobody's fault it's you it's your decision lack of patience not knowing what you want I me mean, if i have someone in my life that is not treating me the way i want to be treated and i feel like i'm giving more to a connection that you are giving be it marriage or relationship i feel like i'm the one um um doing all the work and on top of that you're seeing other people i'm taking on the peers i think there'll come a point where i'll be like no i don't want to do this anymore i deserve better or rather stay single and wait for that person than deal with these peers and when you've made up your mind like that that is when the universe step in and gives you your heart desire you watch tarot reading every day, the same story, the same story. And you're wondering why the, the, the reader is repeating the same energy. It is your energy. It is your energy. You're repeating the same cycle. You're repeating the same cycle over and over again. You might not be with the person right now, but the energy is showing that you would be going back to this person. This person will be coming back. You will re repeat the same cycle again. And some of you go as far as, yeah, I've moved on, I don't care about it for you. But when this person come back, you will take them back. You will take them back. So it's not even about the reading. The reading is just guidance. It's just insight. But a lot of you, you just want the reading to resonate with your current situation. And if it doesn't resonate, um, uh, it's not your reading. It might be a prediction for the future might be a prediction in regards to what's to come all right my dear Leo I think I've said too much um this is all I have for you like what I do appreciate what I do do not forget to give the video a big thumbs up you want a personal reading personal guidance on your situation information for that will be in the description box and I will see you in my next video bye and take care